Hello, this is Sophie Lawson from sophielawson.com and this is another clip lip video where I look at various art books and magazines and today we are looking at this book from Impact Books called Vanishing Point and it's, it's all about perspective for comics from the ground up <laughs> and it's by the artist Jason Cheese Mayer and well this one, if, you're, if you want to learn about perspective I think you're going to love this one so let's get into it Right, Sam can only mean one thing. It's our little friend Ollie. <laughs> I thought I'd pick Ollie because little Ollie the owl, he must have a very strange perspective on life. He's flying about and stuff. I always wonder what does the world look like to birds? It must be quite amazing. I watched on YouTube once these videos of they put a camera on like an eagle and you saw the eagle flying through the mountains and stuff. It's amazing. It's amazing, they're going through these tiny little gaps super fast. I don't know how they do it. Maybe they, they, maybe they see time differently to us or something. <laughs> but this book here, Vanishing Point, now listen to this year. I first heard about this book in 2013 via a podcast called Artists Helping Artists, which is a bit weird because this book is all about comics, basically. But the artist, art in helping artists podcast is all about very traditional artists like very traditional people who really only focus on sort of painting still lifes and stuff but they've still recommended this book so i thought that's amazing because it's, it's it says it's for comics but it's obviously actually it's good for anyone really which is cool it's by jason cheeseman mayer by impact books now what's listen to this yeah I've had this, I got this book in 2013, I've never really looked in it. I feel like I've maybe sort of done, done this before, <laughs> but I've never actually opened the pages and looked at it. So that show. I feel like that's quite naughty really. I keep doing that, I buy all these books and then I never really, they just sit on my shelf. Which is a bit silly I think. But little Ollie's going to help us get into this one and I will say perspective has always been something that scared me but when I've started studying it I realise it's not as scary as, as I thought it was it, some of it looks very complicated the thing is it's rules all you've got to do is learn the rules it's, it's, what's cool about that is you realise that if you learn the rules then you will learn perspective it's not like it's not like a magical skill it's just about learning the rules which is it's very, I feel like that's quite empow in powerful, in, what's it called, in powerful, <laughs> it's quite powerful and inspiring, that's it, because you suddenly realise that if you put the time in, you're going you're gonna to be able to get good at it, it's not like a magical skill, here's little Jason, look, he's quite cool isn't he, little happy chappy, so this, oh there's quite a lot in here, look, Chapter one, what is perspective? Chapter one, one point perspective. Chapter two, one point perspective. Chapter three, two point. Chapter four, three point perspective. Chapter five, don't be a square. <laughs> so it feels like there's a little bit of humour in this one as well. Chapter six, five point pers five point perspective. I've never heard of that before. Chapter seven, four point perspective. Chapter eight, putting it all together. Chapter 9, Tricks and Troubleshooting. And then he's got some final words as well. So here's our little introduction. He looks like he's into his... Well, it, that reminds me a bit of like um, Walking Dead comics or something. So we've got the Tools of the Trade page. It's just your, it's your basic tools and stuff. What is Perspective. Before we can draw anything, you need to learn how to draw with perspectives. <laughs> Look, the railways. I like this. I'm, I'm also going to put links in the in the description to SVS Learn because SVS Learn have got this amazing. They've got a couple of amazing perspective courses, which I've studied from. In fact, I'll put a link to a video of one of the courses that I did. And also Marshall Vandruff as well. Marshall Vandruff on his website, he's got this, he's got this perspective course, 
I think it was only about 10 quid. It's a bargain. And it's very... Well, what I love about Marshall Vandruff is he's funny, but he knows what he's talking about and he's very good at explaining what he's talking about. He's very good at explaining complex things in a way that you understand. But he's got his humour as well, so he makes learning fun. I feel like Marshall Vandruff might actually be the best person to study perspective from because it is quite a complex thing. But it, so if you've got somebody teaching you who's who's fun, it's going to make learning fun, isn't it? If it's all boring and dry, it might actually put you off. I like that image. It might actually put you off learning. So I think fun is quite an important part in learning. Two point perspective. So it looks like there's lots of um, process of it, but I like the way they. I like the way it's set. It's set out. Just looking at it from here, it, I like the way it's set out. It looks very sort of steps, simple steps. It's not going to be overwhelming by the looks of things. Even though it's quite. This is the thing. You look at thing. Well, I look at things like that. It used to. I used to look at that and think, oh, I'm scared of that. So because I was scared, I wouldn't even try it. And then when I started trying it, again, if you're going through it like this, building it up in baby steps, it's amazing how all of a sudden it, it still scares me a little bit though, especially some of the later things. I love his artwork. It's really cool. Little dominoes, look. Yeah, this book looks like it's set out really, really nicely. Oh, I like that. Look, he's suddenly starting to add in how you would actually put it into an image. That's cool, isn't it? Something that, I think it was Jake Parker, or was it David Hone? Some, one of the, I think it might have been David Hone on SVS Learn. He said... What he said was, you've got to learn how to do it, and then once you've learned how to do it, you can start mess. You can start making it up, which sounds a bit weird, but it's almost like you have to go through a lot of learning it before you can have, have fun with it. Because he, he said basically, once you know what you're doing, once you know how, once you know the rules, you can sort of you can sort of mess about with it and start playing around with the perspectives. As long as you're sort of sticking to the rules. So it's almost like perspective gets a lot more exciting when you've learnt all the rules. So it's almost, it is like you have to go through a lot of, I would maybe say, boring. It's, I don't know if it's boring, it's just maybe tedious or something. You have to go through quite a lot of learning, which can be a bit tedious, before it starts to get fun. This is why I think it's important that you're learning from somebody who's doing it fun. I like that. Look at that look, I like that. It's cool, isn't it? Yeah, brilliant. 90 degree cone of vision. So much stuff in this one. Yeah, I like, I like the look of this book. I like the way it's set out. Oh, little ellipses. <laughs> yeah, you don't want to do that. That's what he said. You got, you got to know how not to do it to learn how to do it. It's quite cool. I'll tell you what, Marshall Vandruff had the best way of doing this. The best way of teaching how to do that. <laughs> yeah, it was fun. Because what he did was he made a little square and he went, he, he made it bigger, but he went, ooh. <laughs> It's quite funny that. There's little simple rules you can learn as well. The more the top you see, the less you see the side and stuff. Quite cool. Yeah, see the fun stuff like doing it like this. You've got look what you gotta go through before you can start getting into the fun bits. It's a shame, isn't it? Like it's like that. 
because you sort of want to go straight to the fun. Come on, look at all this now, look. Little zombies. Five point perspective, this is crazy. I've, I don't know what, I don't even know what five point perspective is. Look, I mean, if you imagine if you just jumped straight to that, you would not know what you were doing, I don't think. That's what I'm saying, you've got to go through it in, you've got to build on top of it all. Because look at that, that would, that would scare me, that. Looking at that. <laughs> That's just mental. It looks like my grid though. I had a psychedelic experience. I saw a grid just like that. Yeah, with a sphere. This is balance. This is positive, negative, positive, negative. And then what you've got is, that's the balance point. It's quite interesting how everything in life seems to follow rules. Things that you don't think are following rules, are there's actually rules underneath them. It's quite strange. Because you think... You think things are all random and stuff, but it's not. Four point perspective. I mean, this is getting mad, isn't it? Yeah. They never, they never went into this sort of thing at SVS Learn. They kept it very simple, which I like that. If I had seen this sort of thing, I would... Oh, cool, look at that. <laughs> look, oh, look at this, look. How cool is that? He's jumping through, through the scene. I like that. He's got it up here, look. It's crazy, this is. Oh, I like that. Huh? Repeating walls. Who was it? Somebody else said about that. When you're doing your comics. I think, it might, I think it might be in Jonathan Rector again. Putting it all together, look. Cool. Yeah, what I like about this, this one here is it's actually really focused on teaching. I like that. You can, I can tell it's actually going to be really easy to learn from this. It's the way I like things done. <laughs> you little um, little little stick man things. Cool. Yeah, and you also get the final image as well. I like that. That's brilliant, isn't it? The perspective on it. Oh, this is brilliant. It's like he's taking apart one of his images and... Yeah, I like that. Tricks and troubleshooting. That'd be fun. Special vanishing points. Oh, this is little shortcuts and background fakes. Yeah, again, this is sort of what he was talking about on SVS Learn. You can start sort of, you can start sort of doing, making it look like perspective without actually having to do the work of working out the perspective. Because you sort of know what perspective should look like. I like that. That's what he said on SVS Learn. I like that as well, look. A little subtle shift in the perspective. Tricks and tricks and cheats. Put down that ruler. Yeah. Make it look more natural. And that's it. Parting words. Let's have a look at this. Look. And remember, have fun. You're creating entire wor worlds in these little boxes. Go draw. I love that. Even there, look. You can see he's, he's saying, focus on how to do the boxes. And then turn the boxes into worlds. 
Yeah, don't focus on the world, focus on the boxes, but the boxes are the world. That's cool, isn't it? Don't get yourself overwhelmed with trying to draw the world. Focus on the box. That also goes into what David Hone said on SVS Learn. He said everything can be put into boxes. So all you need to do is study and learn how boxes and cubes look in perspective. And then you can draw anything, he said. Because what he said was, he said you can carve out of the, the cube. Carve out of the cube to create your shapes. <laughs> it's quite cool, isn't it? And then we've got all the little things here as well. Da -da -da. And then we've got some more books. Fantasy characters. That looks quite cool. Incredible car comics. What's that? Hell Beasts. And then Manga Pro Superstar Workshop. I don't really like the, um, the covers that they pick on their books. I feel like their covers are always a little bit too hectic. I prefer clean and crisp covers like this, look. Look at that for a cover. Clean and crisp. This one's a bit too hectic. I think less is more sometimes. I hope you enjoyed that though. That was the book Vanishing Point by Jason Cheeseman Mayer by Impact Books. Perspective for comics. And I'll see you later for another one.